Chenna, my friend. It's been four years we came to Lagos in search of Bina Pastor. Unfortunately, this morning, we found him dead. Mm. Take heart, my son. What a pity. It's okay, Baba. This is my brother, Obinna. Baba, I greet you. Um, you are welcome. Well, um, before we go further, how did you find me? I'm very sure I've not attended to you before. And uh, you don't look like our people. Uh, that's, that's so true, Baba. Our village is so far away in Imo State. You know, we were looking for a place that we can get a cheap environment so that we will preserve his body before taking him to the village tomorrow. So someone now directed us to your place. That's how we found here. Okay, okay, okay. Well, uh, I believe in finding every cause of every problem under the sun. Baba, <laughs> only God can do that. Let the heads be laid first before we talk about action them. Uh, now tell me, <laughs> what is the cause of his death? Uh, Baba, honestly, we, we cannot tell you the cause of his death. That's, we just brought him so that you will embalm him. We will take, when we go back to the village, you start looking for the cause with yes, his death. Yes, yes. Please, we don't have time and tomorrow we'll be taking him back to the village. Please, just help us. Forget about finding what happened to him. Please. Okay. Do you want me to find the cause of his death as well as the embalmment? I don't. Is, is that necessary? No, no, no. no it's, uh, that, um, Baba, that is not necessary. We, we just need you to do the bamboo. Moreover, the cost of finding out the dead, the cost of the dead, might be too expensive that we cannot afford it. Just help us do the 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 the, the environment, sir. Baba, we will find out the cost of his death when we get to our village. Exactly. Yeah. I'm full of empathy for you, young man. Don't worry, I will do it for free of charge. <laughs> but we, are, we appreciate you. <laughs> but there's no need to, to start looking for the cause. No, no, no need. Sir. Mm -hmm. Just do the environment, that's all. Okay. Baba. We'll be back to take him to the village tomorrow morning. Uh, yes. Please, yes. do a good job so that his body will not start decomposing on our way home. Don't worry about my job. Hmm? Mm. Worry about your condition. Now, take him inside. Okay, Baba. Just the environment, eh? No need to start looking for... I said take him inside. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Baba. Thank you. Good morning. 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 Good morning.
Yes, Baba. We told you we have a long way to go. Mm. Yes. Alright. Um, I'm not the one to delay your journey. Hmm? I've done my own part. Even if you leave it here for three days, it will not decompose. Wow, wow, wow. Mm. Baba, thank you very much. Yes. You're really a man of integrity. Yes. Thank you, sir. Yes. And meanwhile, Baba, um, my brother suggested we buy you this drink. Though we've paid you, but this is uh, an appreciation. Mm. Yes. <laughs> thank you, Baba. Thank you. Nice one. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. <coughs> Oh, thank you very much. Uh, you can go there and carry your brother's cup. Oh, oh okay. Hmm? That's right there. Hey. You said you don't want to know the cause of his death. Uh, Baba, we would have loved to, but exactly. our place is very far. Mm. Mm. That's where we will go. We have to start uh, living because we don't have to. Uh, before you leave, uh, let me pray for you. You see, with this drink you gave to me, hmm, I pray for Johnny Messis. Amen. Hmm? You will... You will reach home in good time. And you will meet your people in good health. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, um, what's okay. it? Uh, what's it? You will not disturb their journey. Amen. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. For it is love they are showing to you. Hmm? Thank yeah, you, you can go now. Thank you, Baba. We really appreciate it. All right.
one to ten kilobit. Coming from a fireplace because your friend has fallen. Oh, we want to thank you, people, for making it possible for us to see the cups of our son. The world is like a relay race. When you could not complete your race, your brother will help you. So thank you for bringing him home to our people. Thank you. Thank you. You are welcome. You are welcome. Thank you. We are your brothers. And we are here because we heard cry of bereavement. That is why we are gathered. Sorry. Take heart. What happened? No, we are welcome. You are welcome. You see, <clears throat> as you people are saying is the way I'm saying it. All I know is that, or all I heard is that he lives in Yoruba land. I don't even know where he lives in Yoruba land. Because do you mean that you don't know where your son lived before he died? I never knew he even lives in Yoruba land. Hey, that's, we are living in Idiroko. Hey. That's where we walk. Sir. Thank you. Thank you for saving us from this shame. Because you should be ashamed of yourself. That you, you are here telling us that you don't know where your son lived before he died. Hey. It is a very shameful thing to say the least. Oh, no, I don't like the way you are talking to me. Have you come to laugh at me? Have you turned to add salt to injury? It's okay. You are very, very stupid. You are very, very stupid to tell us you, you don't know where your son lived. Oh, no, we we'll look at him. Are you already making a defense for yourself? That you don't know where your your son, where he lived before he died. I only know he lived in Yoruba land. What is Yoruba land? Hey, I am ashamed of you. Ikechugu, I am ashamed of you. I am thoroughly disappointed in you. So when you came begging, asking us for a wife. We gave you our daughter, didn't we? Oh, yes! But we did not know that she is going to be like a sheep without a shepherd. Oh! Eh, uh, it is true. You are not um, Uchenna's uh, biological father. You are not his biological father. And so, this is Africa. In your capacity as the head of this family, you are now Uchenna's father. Whether you like it or not. Mom! In law, I am sorry. I am very sorry. You people gave us a wife, a mother, a woman that was so fruitful. She had a lot of children for us. Though death came and cleared all of them. This Uchenna that was remaining that we thought we had. Look at him dying down. I am sorry. Please. <clears throat> you are fine. You are fine. Which one I mean, be, 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 you are telling us I am fine. Look at which one lying here. And you are all you can say is I am, I am, I am fine. You, you know what will become of you when I gather my kinsmen here and leave this place. You know, don't you? It doesn't, it doesn't got into that. You cannot leave. Because whatever you do now, you're doing it against this small boy lying down I get to really shut up. Eh? Shut up. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. <laughs> Please. Tell us. What happened to your friend? <laughs> My dad. <laughs> 
it was on the second day of April <laughs> this year. We came back from a site where we work. New children started complaining of severe headache. Usually we, we feel headache after such work. We thought it's just a normal headache. I and my brother said, okay, let's, because we don't usually take drugs. But to our greatest surprise, the next day, the headache continued. <laughs> then we said, okay, let us go to the site and do some other job. Then we can get some money to buy him drugs. He insisted on following us. <laughs> nah. Take it easy. He was there. <laughs> he became so sick. <laughs> we had to take him home. <laughs> Uchenna, what is it? Are you okay? What is the problem? This must be typhoid fever. Typhoid fever? Yes. That headache he had was just a sign of it. I think so. I think so. So, uh, 
What do we do now? We are still working. Just... If we don't finish this work, this man will not pay us now. The we'll, day is still very early. We'll finish hmm? it. We must finish it. Huh? Let's take him under that tree. Then after the work, we can take him home. Okay. Let's keep him there for to rest. Yes. Yeah. I think it's the I think that's what we we'll do. We need to do that for you now. Let's see. Ha! How do you think we're doing now? Ha! I beg you. I beg. <laughs> hey! So, we had to gather money and call the doctor, actually not a doctor, a chemist, because we cannot afford the service of a doctor. When she came and checked on me, but they told her that Uchenda is dead. Hey! Now Uchenda died, Uchenda died. Oh. Just said that. Oh. <laughs> my brother has been sick. <laughs> This narrative that we have just made, how do you feel? All of you. The first one, headache, which is not father. The second one, which is not mother, headache, which is not headache. His children, headache. 
Onowu, there is something about this headache. And we must trace the source of this headache Mom. to this house. Somebody has wiped out my sister and the family. Somebody who has interest. This death is unnatural. Oh no, according to tradition, we must seek to find the source of this continuous death. <clears throat> what killed my sister is in this family. And it is in your place. Oh no, it is in your place to ensure that justice is done. Mom. There is a killer in our midst. Somebody is killing this family. Oh no. <clears throat> oh no. <clears throat> oh no. We were not living with Uchenia at Yoruba land. Look at the boy that just explained this to us. They were all living together. He has just told us what happened to Uchenia. So how can somebody be saying that? You should not be buried. Oh no, you and I know that as small as Uchenna, his corpse should not be kept overnight. He has to be buried. <coughs> I am the owner, and I am the custodian of culture and tradition of this kingdom. Once there is an allegation, we will suspend the burial until we conduct inquest. Mom, so hold your peace. Uchenna will not be buried. Tomorrow, he will be coming with a medical doctor that will conduct an inquest and find out what killed Uchenna. Okay, he yes. will be buried. Yes. Because this headache thing is too much. Bury what? Oh no, this is not good though. Let us bury this boy. He's a small boy. They will not bury him. At our age. You know, they will not the bury him. Of the Lord eh? is the position of blood. Oh no, which position? It is the that what you want to die. die. Let that that is small boy you die. What do you want to die? You keep the small boy overnight in this community. Oni Ozu. Oni Ozu. I have never seen where it happened. Oni Ozu, how many deaths have you buried in two weeks? You still want to bury more. You still want to bury more. You. You. The gods will shame you. We are not going to bury him until an inquest is conducted. Bury him as if by a bury this corpse. Let's go. Let's go. Anyway, let's go. You want to be there? You want to bury him? No, bury him. Let's go. Bury him. Let's go. You are not tired of burial. Let's go. Let's go. Come down. Come down. Who is not tired of burial? Come down. You want to bury? Come down. Hey, you want to bury? Come down. Ike Chuku. Ike Chuku. Which is not going to be buried. Ah. Until we conduct the inquest. Ah. Oh, no. That will be tomorrow. This is not good, oh no. Ah. Hey. Let's bury this boy. Hey. Hey. hey! What do we do now? What do we do with the cops? Hey! Ah. <laughs> we cannot bury him. What I'm have saying. I done? Ah. <laughs> um, Mazokoro. We are not happy with what you did today. You have succeeded in suffering the corpse of Uchenna and added to the pains and anguish of the morning public. Is it good? I did nothing wrong. You were here when Elendo said that witches from our village killed Uchenna. Until we clear ourselves of that allegation, we will not proceed with the burial of Ujedna. But the method you used is totally strange to us. 
It had never happened before. At all. Do not make our ancestors to visit us with the Nikudi or with the with the brocho. What you? I can't even What what method? What method has never worked? One, you failed to conduct the inquest. Two, you postponed the barrier for which the uh, inquest was organized. Mm -hmm. eh? Yes. Just because of common allegation. Uh -uh. Look, no matter the level of allegation, you should, mm -hmm. the, the barrier would have gone on. Eh? Take for instance, when my wife died, you know that her people accused me of killing her. But I never postponed her barrier. At all? Eh? You went along and buried her? Went along, went, went ahead and buried her. I still remember that until now, that allegation by your in-laws is still hanging on our neck. Now that's the reason our young men cannot marry from their village. In fact, you have totally destroyed our tradition and custom. We are finished. Yeah? Did you fall for? Uh -uh. Huh? The moment I heard that you are going to assume the position of Ono Wu in place of your late father, I know <laughs> that doom, trouble was being spread for our kingdom. I know it. You are mad. You are the one that is mad and not only mad. Wait, wait. Senseless. What, what is even wrong with us? What is wrong with both of you? We've had enough trouble in this land. Eh? Mazukuru, your idea appears so wonderful. But let me tell you, it is a wonderful rubbish. <laughs> That's, that is what you say. But all I know is that what I am doing is blending modern means with what our ancestors gave us. Here I am. Just look at it. Blender. Mm. Ah. <laughs> what they are doing now is what is called traditional aberration. I'm telling you! You must Let not let us not do the wrong thing in the name of doing the right thing. Oh. Is a small boy compared to our age. His corpse should not be kept longer than necessary. Mm -hmm. Please let us stop this inquest and bury him tomorrow. Bury his corpse tomorrow morning. Impossible. Eh? I said impossible. Hey. <laughs> Were you not there when they learned to say that witches from our village killed Uchenna? What will Elendo and his people say of us? Yes, let me tell you, if you have something to hide, I have nothing to hide. And besides, Elendu is coming here tomorrow with a doctor who will conduct autopsy on Uchenna. Elendu said that witches from our village have wiped out his sister's children. Eh? And until that allegation is cleared, we will not conduct any barrier. Oh, nah. Let us go. Oh, nah. See, Tomorrow. let me tell you. Mazokuro, I have nothing to hide at all. But you don't get answers by asking too many questions. Let us go. Okoro, the other is better. Let me hear These people are trying to attract so much attention to them. Thereby, it's business to shame and for the whole section. I'm really concerned about it because if they continue this way, they will find out the truth about Uchenna's death. They will also know that Uchenna wasn't able to feed himself and couldn't even pay his house rent. No, we can't allow it to happen. Honestly, we can't. Let me ask you this question. Do you know Oka's son, the pastor? Yeah, the one that normally hold crusade at the primary school field. Exactly. Okay. The people that attended this crusade said he claimed to have said many men and women free from which cannot. <laughs> and how is that our business? We can talk him into convincing one of the witches to come and claim uh, the responsibility for 
to the man's diet. So that is done. Eh? We are free. We cannot go ahead and bury him without anything. And what will be his gain from this? <laughs> I hope you're not taking him for a fool. Do that for me to handle. Let us go and see him first. Okay, let's go. Let's go. What? How do you expect an ordained man of God like me to do that? Uh, Pastor Lost. Forget about this miracle. We all know how we do that. And we know that those people that come to confess about everything is those that believe in you. Those that are it's something you walk all of them. Eh? You walk it out with them, agree with them. You know it. Or do you want me to expose you to the villager? No, 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 no. no. Master of one crew. It has not got into that, eh? It has not got into that. But please, if, if I do this, what is in for me? Mm -hmm. Now we are talking. Number one, I will keep your secrets. Okay? Number two, the women party people don't believe. In your miracles, but the confession from a witch, but confession from a witch, you made them believe you. Yeah? Then number three, it will make you get more customers. No, I'm just, uh, just members. And you know, the more members you get, the more money you make. So tell me, how can you convince? The witch to come forward to the public and speak. As a small thing to him now, huh? the same way he convinces them to go to that uh, and go to and all this deliverance with him and cast the devils away from them. The same way he will convince them to come back. Huh? It's what in a pastor, you know, now nah? you know what you know what you know what you <laughs> So this so-called witch. He or she will suffer, be punished for something he or she does not know about. And if it happens like that, he will be forced to speak out, which is what I'm avoiding. And that's why we're getting it all wrong. And that is why we're getting it all wrong. In Christianity, if a person confesses to a pastor, that person shall be free. When the pastor will come out with his own line of defense. You hear me? Yeah. Ah. Mm. Judgment is for God alone. Judgment is for God alone. <laughs> pastor, you see, I know you are, you are only a man of God. Thank you. A man of God indeed. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. We shall see tomorrow. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> you get you? Mm -hmm. Let's be on our way. Okay. Let's go. Hey. Watch out. <laughs> if it doesn't show up. We need a change of plan. Don't hmm. hmm. mind. Don't worry yourself. He has no choice. He must show up. I can assure you this. Let us go home and get ready for tomorrow. Okay, if you say so. <laughs> My people, I greet all of you. We greet you. We greet you. No, no. Um, I want to thank all of you for making our time to be here on this second day of the inquest. Hopefully, uh, we shall conclude soon and then uh, we'll bury our brother. Oh, no. Somebody is breaking up. Oh, Pastor, is that you? Mm, yes. Uh, step I am out. the one. Step out. Um, one thing I know is that you are against some of our customs and traditions. Uh, and I also know 
that he who is not for us is against us. Well, I'm afraid I'll have to rethink about that, especially about the inquest. The inquest is good. That's how it is. Even the white man that brought your religion does it. Oh. What is inquest? It's just to find out the cause of the death. That's all. By the grace of God Almighty, I was able to deliver many witches and wizards, both in our village and in the neighboring villages. Witches, it's no longer use. We've all heard about it. Do you believe all these mushroom pastors? One of the witches' confession will be interesting to you. Go ahead. Tell us we are yes. The Lord has done a great thing in this young lady's life. Come on. Is that a Her life will never remain the same again. And from now on, the Lord will put her in the path of a great glory. God has told me what he will do in the life of this young lady. She has something to say. Akuna, let's hear you. Omo, what do you want to hear from a mad woman? What? As you can see, we don't have time. I am okay. We don't have time. And it is about to rain. Uh, Marzia Lendo, let us hear her. After all, the pastor said that God told him something about her. What do you know? Tell us. Do you want to doubt the God Almighty? God himself arrested her. He is omnipotent, omniscient, and then omnipresent. Let's hear what you have to say. I am a witch. Yay! I killed Uchena. Yay! I'm a witch. A witch? How did you kill him? Tell us. I put a stone in his head and it developed severe headache. Remember, Amechi said Uchena had a severe headache. The stone is not a physical stone, it's a spiritual stone. When they put it in your head, you will experience a severe headache. When they put it in your stomach, you will experience a stomach ache. When they put it in your womb, you will become barren. It is a dangerous weapon that the devil is using to fight all of us who are God's children. But God, through me, has liberated his children. Then what happened? Then I, the next day, I followed him to his place of work. And I saw him under a mango tree. And then I poured him something and killed him. Remember. That Amechi said when they got back, they discovered a white substance were on his body. That was a spiritual acid. May God not allow your enemies to succeed in pouring a spiritual acid on your body. First, Amechi told us. That they did not take him to the mango tree. Rather, he walked there himself. No. But, Pastor, how did you get to know all this? You were not here yesterday. Mm -hmm. The neighbors told me, even before Akuna confessed. Besides, the news is all over the village. I knew it! I knew it! I knew that Uchenna was killed by witchcraft. Now that we all know the truth, why don't we go and bury Uchenna in peace?
I think my VK Chukwu is right. You are the one killing the tradition that you are meant to protect. Akuna, you are not a witch. I am a witch. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Uchena was jobless. He had no wife. He had no children. He lived under a bridge in Yoruba land. Tell me, what on earth we attract a witch to kill a nobody? Oh. I ask you, Akuna, speak! Why not? Ask, ask, ask him. Ask me what? <laughs> Have you gone mad? Yeah. Oh, I see. Oh no, who was right? You are mad. I'm not a witch. Huh? Yeah. Who is that you? I'm not a witch. Which one is from you? Oh, what are you doing, baby? Oh, Oh, Baba Asta. He asked me to say all these things. No. He, he promised to give me food every day. Yeah. He even told me what God will do for me. I'm not a witch. Oh, no. May God save you from witchcraft and deliver you from madness as well. Pastor. 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 Thank you, Shubsaya, for this revelation. Otherwise, you would have been, been, been bamboozled by this fake pastor. Mm. Now that the truth mm. is open now. Let's go back to the beginning. Oh no, let us not take this matter serious. I am sure that the pastor must have been bewitched by this lady. Exactly. This whole world has become a puzzle. Huh? <clears throat> oh no, somebody's at the back. He wants to talk. Okay, doctor. <coughs> Greetings, my elders. Greetings. Greetings, Ono. Please, can I see Amechi, the young man that brought Uchenna's corpse home? You should be the one to be asking of me. But I was told there were two of them that came here. Well, I haven't seen them again. Amechi cannot come out. He is sick. He has been stooling. I suspect diarrhea. His eyes are so red and swollen. That is the point. Please, can you take me to him? Hello. Mysteries everywhere, tragedy and frustrations abound. Everyone has a question to ask, but the answers are nowhere to be found. The outcome is in the father's thoughts, only the mother knows the truth.
I suspect I mean she died of Ebola disease. Is he dead? Yes, he's dead. Mm. I also suspect that Uchenna must have died of it too. You see, that young man inside there, nobody should go close to him. I must have to go get the Ministry of Health to come and take charge. He must have to be quarantined. I will go, to go and talk to him. Hey, please. Chief Okoro, kindly go and disperse the crowd. While we go on it. Yes. Hey! Hmm. Have you come with another strange idea and plan? Are you not tired of intrigues? I mean, tell us what they know. Why did you just dispatch this meeting like that? Why can't you tell us why you are dismissing the meeting in this way? Do you think we are cows? Wait, even if you think we are cows, that's the way you handle cows. Talk to us, Onowoko. Uh -huh. My God, there is fire on the mountain. Something greater than the might of the might I don't think this will waste your energy. We all disperse. No. The town cry will go round. You know, what could that be? Tell us. When I entered the room with the doctor, what I saw with my eyes, what I saw with my eyes, I'm waiting to stand. Hey, him? Yeah. That is what he's doing. He died of this strange disease called Ebola. But as I talked to him, the entire Ikeji is in trouble. Hey, our village is in trouble. Let me sound this as a break. If you see anybody with severe headache, Anybody that is drooling and vomiting, bleeding, eh? Hey. Alert everyone so that you the head workers. There is danger. Tell the blind to see with his mind. Tell the deaf to hear with his heart. Tell the unborn the world is tough. Tell the dead to rest in peace. Tell the mourner to mourn with care. Tell the villagers the truth and don't lie in my presence. Hey. I do not understand you, see. You know nothing about the truth, oh no. Doctor, step forward. You said Uchena and his friend died of Ebola, right? Yes, of course. Ebola was discovered this year, right? Yes, last month. Last month. Besides. Mr. Elendu. You accused Mr. Ikechuku of killing your sister and her husband, right? Yes. yes, it is true. But now, I know the truth. Doctor, how long does it take 
for someone to contact and die of Ebola? Just two days. The third day, the person is dead. Final. Mr. Elendo, when did your sister and her family die? Yes, they, 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 they died uh, two years ago. Yes, two years ago. After your wife and her child died, right? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Doctor. Yes? If Ebola kills in just three days, how come his parents contacted it when it never existed? Mystery. I must have to go and make some research. There is no I'll... need for your research. Mazi Elendu, tell us what happened to your sister's family. Why? You are the one that seemed to know everything. Tell us what happened to them. I command you to speak now! Eugene is my in-law. He is also my friend. But Eugene broke my heart. And I have taken a vow that I will never forgive him. Never! Hey. Ah, Eugene. Ah, Eugene. Hmm? Hmm. Ah, good morning, sir. Okay. How are you? I'm fine. How are you doing? Um, they are all fine. Mm -hmm. Chief, um, my goods just arrived at the warehouse, mm -hmm. and uh, my car broke down. I'm here to ask, see if you can give me your key so that I can drive down to the warehouse and open it for the container. Ah, so yes. this problem now. But when do you need the car? No, 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 no. Hey, now, now, now. Yes, chief. I want to take my wife to the market and drop my daughter off at school. Uh, don't worry about that. I will take care of them. I will drop them to school and market them out from there. Go to the warehouse. Okay, okay, it's alright. Okay, okay. Thank you, Chief. Mm. Yeah, follow me, follow me. Baby, where are you? Drive careful, you. I will, I will. Drive careful. Bye bye, honey. Now it has happened the other way around. 
Very sorry. Very sorry. Very sorry. Hey! Now that the burial is over, I want to leave this village with my family because everything in this village reminds me about the bad things that have occurred. You have to take heart. Hmm? Be a man. Okay? to take my leave. Come on you today. Ah. Uh, sorry, eh? 
sorry, sorry. I will not believe you. Oh my God! No. Gods of vengeance, I come to you for mercy. I think they have suffered enough. Please, withdraw your anger and show mercy. Show mercy, they have suffered enough. Show your mercy. Show your mercy. Show your mercy. The cause was irreversible. That was how I lost my sister, her husband, and her children. My brother, you. Yeah. 
hard to slaughter. A white rind. Sprinkle the blood all over this copper. Yes. Anybody that take refuge here will die. Now that the truth is known, I think we'll bury the cops. Oh.